we're, we're talking today mostly about infosec skills and just the, the notion of subscription-based training. So as, as online training becomes more ubiquitous, uh, what are your thoughts on subscription-based training versus boot camp or academic scu- sub, uh, study of a subject? Is it sort of the way of the future, you think? Yeah, so I think um, the way that we're seeing things is that people are looking for training for the need they have when they need it, right? Mm-hmm. Um, and colleges tend to be slower to adopt to that. Yeah. Uh, so having have been a, a college professor before and the, the course author for the, the school that I was teaching for, um, if I wanted to make a change, it took almost three years to go through, change out the books in the bookstore, change out the curriculum, and start teaching something new. Uh-huh. In, in computers, that's just too slow, right? Um, a lot of schools are trying to get around, uh, trying to speed up that timeline by using electronic books now instead of paperbacks and all that kind of stuff. Um, but they just can't compete as far as as quickly as commercial sector can. So the great thing with when you deal with um, boot camps, whether in person or online, uh, or a subscription-based service, is that they can create content much quicker and get it out much quicker. Um, I look at like for our company when we put out a course for InfoSec Skills, uh, we can go from idea to execution in under 30 days. Sometimes as much as you know, the longest it takes us is about 90 days usually for mm-hmm. one course, um, and, and that's because we're doing most of the stuff in house. We're able to, you know, shoot the video, edit the video, write the curriculum, get everything done, and, and meet those needs very, very quickly. As far as for students, I find that from a cost-benefit perspective, the online subscription services are excellent, right? Mm-hmm. InfoSec Skills is, for one low payment, you get access to the entire library of courses, right. which is awesome, right? Um, and, and this isn't just a commercial for InfoSec Skills. Obviously, this is your guys' podcast, so sure, but I mean, sure. there, there's, there's tons of other competitors out there, right? I mean, right now, there's probably 40 or 50 different companies, and so you got to look at the catalog of what they offer and which one's the best for you with the instructors that you like and the way they teach, um, because I, I tell students this all the time. You know, you may not like me, and I'm not the, the teacher you want. That's okay. There's 50 other guys who teach the exact same thing, right? If you want right. to learn uh, Security Plus, there are at least 50 courses online you can go take Security Plus at. Uh, mine is one of them. Hopefully you like my, my methods and we have a really high success rate getting students to pass the exam and teaching stuff. Um, but not everybody likes my personality and that's okay, right? Uh, and, and I think that's important for students because when you start dealing with these online subscription sites, it is very student driven. The student has to be motivated. Um, when, when I'm teaching a boot camp, an employer can say, you know what, you need to go to boot camp for the five days and they put you in my class and that's your place of business for that week. Um, you're going to kind of be forced to learn. But a lot of these subscriptions, you're doing it on your own time in nights and weekends or at your lunch hour. And so you have to be motivated to want to do it. But if you're that motivated person, you can save a ton of money and learn pretty much anything you want using these type of trainings. And note to our listeners, of course, Jason Dion is the teacher that you want. (laughs) (laughs) Of course. (laughs) 